So Jake walked away with six hundred ninety thousand dollars for the fight. Ask Askren uh, five hundred k for the fight. Right? If they ever do a pay per view on a boxing with Jake, he could make multiples of that. Let me just get this clear. Did, so Jake won. Yeah. You, do you think it was rigged? No, <laughs> I don't. He knocked I, him out in the first round. Yeah, and, and and this whole thing is like Rob. Right? He was a YouTuber. He and his brother were YouTubers, and they're both yeah. they're both I, boxing. Yeah, yeah. Jake and Logan. Yes, I, I did see his fight against uh, the former basketball player and uh, Nate Robinson. Yeah, yeah, and he looked like he had some. You know, he's probably got some some boxing history somewhere along the way. You know, yeah, he's a YouTube sensation. But even if he doesn't, you know, maybe maybe he's he's found his calling. Uh, and, I mean, give the guys do. I mean, if he keeps doing it it's at some point. Another I mean, story. We're all, we all love quality entertainment. And <laughs> some think boxing or UFC or MMA is not quality entertainment. And that's fine. No, I love yeah, that. I like it. I'm a huge fan of that. I just, I, I remember back in the, remember Butterbean? Remember Bean? Oh, love Butterbean. Had a chance to meet, meet. Butter. Oh, you did? Yeah. Uh, you know, I think about, when I think about the, like the, just the, the, uh, the non-professional, I, I, I don't know how, what term to use, the non-professional and, and, uh, Jake Paul would be one of those, you know, just kind of like a, where do they come from? Right. Or it doesn't, doesn't look like they should be Butterbean didn't look like he should be in a ring. Nope. <laughs> but he, Hey, if he hits you, you knew you were, you were in there with a, with a guy who knew how to fight.